Hi Aries. Your tarot cards reading by M um, for the second part of July, 15 to the 31st of July. So, Queen of Wands. The world influenced by Ace of Wands. I will check the position of the cards just now, just to make sure if everything is visible. So, Queen of Wands, right, with four of cups. The world with Queen of Pentacles. Okay, influenced by the five of wands. Look, this is your influencing energy. There is a lovely idea. It's out there. Might be, in fact, that is not your idea, being that you have this five of wands, indecisive, conflicting, not being sure, not understanding, um, not being ready also. But uh, um, it tells me that this um, ace of wands perhaps comes externally from someone, somebody, some situation comes very favorably towards you. Ace of Wands is very promising energy, something which is supposed to be prosperous, something which you're supposed to like. This is passionate energy. Oh, I love it. I like it, you know. But you were kind of very conflicting about that. You were. You were. Okay, we were still talking influencing energy. But still, great idea, great opportunity, whether that came from you or from somebody else or a situation just arose in front of you, like fantastic opportunity for you. Yeah, but opportunity, fantastic opportunity, beautiful opportunity was there. Now, look, I like Queen of Wands as your energy, as visible energy out there. Queen of Wands likes to be visible, likes to put things public, not shy, doesn't have fear, that sort of energy. Now, I suppose that you will be talking about this idea because Queen of Wands is holding just that stick, just that idea, just that opportunity in her hands. Okay, it says you owe this opportunity you took it for yourself you understood it's good for you you're liking it you're loving it you don't see problem in realizing it queen of wands doesn't have problem that one is i don't know fearless that sort of joyful energy oh i can do this is something which i like i can go there i can make it i can do it that sort of easy going okay but very how can i put it but that um, doesn't come from foolishness it comes from confidence. That one, as I said, doesn't have fear. A very important component of that energy, not fearing. So that idea, that opportunity which you did have just earlier, okay, that's something which you were coming with into this part of the month, okay, you can, you can make, you can create it. I mean, you are very much aware of it. Queen of Wands, fearless, brave, joyful, excited <laughs> about what is going to create next because this is great opportunity. It will create it just now. We'll enjoy it in the meantime. You see where I'm going with this lovely energy. Queen of Wands, I love. It's actually very suitable for you. It's sort of maybe more to Sagittarius, okay? But still, it's a fire energy. Aries, Sagittarius, Leo. You see what I'm saying? Very suitable um, for you as well. And as I said, public energy. So whatever that's on your mind, whatever that you are planning to create, this opportunity is all public. It's all visible. You are talking about that. You're not shy. The energy of Queen of Wands is fearless, not shy, excited, brave. Great, beautiful. But look uh, what we have underneath. This is within you. Underneath we have this five of uh, wands and then we have four of cups. Opportunity given, okay. Um, that what you have around you, it seems to me. This is what you are showing yourself like and that is great, okay. But this is... Um, within you, okay, that's energy within you, that's what you feel like, it seems to me that you still hold some of these problems, maybe things were um, seemingly too big, 
too good to be true, too excited. You see what I'm saying? And you were showing excitement because somebody told you, because somebody, something came towards you. Oh, this is exciting energy. And you were playing along, okay? But yet, you were still thinking. You still have some sort of... These are not doubts, okay? I don't see doubts with five of wands, and need that with four of cups. It's only that you need time to use to it, to use to this idea, to plan this opportunity maybe, to sit on it a little bit, to sit on it. That's what you need. Though you are not showing um, any any um, hesitation, you will not show it as uh, uh, out there, but you will have it within yourself. You will need to sit on this idea, on everything which is happening out there might be something which involves travel, other part of the world, other career places or something, might be something like that, could be change of your career completely, uh, changing job, look there is Queen of Pentacles and the world, we can talk energies which you find when you are changing the way um, how you make your money, how you make your living, you change your residence could also be with the world and the queen of pentacles nothing wrong we do have something very successful something accomplished here queen of pentacles is very happy there that does have something accomplished does have some money does have some job does have something and can begin based on that okay can begin something else this is very interconnected particularly with the world things interconnected in your job so you perhaps getting your offer okay maybe job offer career offer based on that what you do based on that how you earn your money maybe amount of money which you were having so you will invest now you will get this new opportunity because you've got this skill, because you've done this. You see what I'm saying? Queen of Pentacles is sitting energy, enjoying that, what she has. I am insisting on something which you do have. Your knowledge, your home, your business, your money, based on that, okay? Something you accomplished already in that, in that regard, based on that, you can start something else which is enormously exciting. <laughs> this is something very, very prosperous. Could very well be career um, it, when we talk wands, okay? We are talking change of career, something very creative out there, creating different type of life. Could could just be something like that in different part of the world, different place with a different company or a different business now. But yeah, might be very much connected to your business career, money-making, place of residence as well. But nothing wrong, it seems things are happening for you. Might be a bit too fast, okay? Even for your taste, Aries, if that can be, okay? Because you are not showing any hesitation, that's for sure. But you will, you will have um, a little bit of something within yourself, okay? Which you are not, show not showing to other people, of course. Um, but things are happening. Very, very exciting energy. That's why I think that must be something, you know, like bow wow, some super opportunity, some super offer. <laughs> you see what I'm saying? If you, Aries person, eh? Uh, are hesitant, you know, to believe, to jump immediately or so. But yeah, you will anyway go after this opportunity because you will, very soon you will realize, okay, what does it really mean? What it contains, in fact, because Queen of Pentacles is grounded, is solid, knows it, can do it. <laughs> this is a very solid energy. So yeah, it's your hesitation. It's not going to last long. You will realize that this opportunity is real. Anyway, Aries, I really hope that you're gonna enjoy this part of July and I will speak to you again um, very soon. Till then, best regards. Terabai M.